Just over a week ago, Renelle Harper, a young Indigenous woman from northern Manitoba, was brutally attacked and left to die by the river in Winnipeg. Because of her incredible strength and the support of her family and her friends, she is getting better. But until Canadians as a whole address violence against Indigenous women, the violence will not stop. So the question is, when will this government take leadership to put an end to violence against women, come up with an action plan, support the families, so that what Renell went through and what thousands of Indigenous women go through will never happen again? And again, this was a horrific crime, and I commend uh, the Harper family for their courage and determination throughout this ordeal. Absolutely. And we understand, again, that the, the police have arrested two suspects in this case thanks to the family's brave decision to go public with their story and work closely with the police. But, Mr. Speaker, there's been more than 40 studies into the plight of missing and murdered Aboriginal women, and now is not the time for more studies. Now is the time for action, and she mentioned that there was no action plan, and there is an action plan, and we are supporting women and girls and Aboriginal women and girls across Canada. The minister's so-called action plan isn't working. The number of women continues to pile up and the Rennell Harper tragedy is the latest in a litany of horrors experienced by Aboriginal women. Approximately 1,200 women and girls have gone missing or been murdered. Aboriginal communities are calling for a national inquiry so that finally the issue of violence against women is taken seriously. Enough stonewalling. Why are the Conservatives blocking an inquiry?